video for game at the end. Okay, so let's just start throwing and catching, exploring. Make sure you have appropriate personal space, being careful of what's above you, and just throw and catch the ball however you want to, okay? Any way you want. You could do a special trick. You could throw with one hand. You could try spinning and catching, or you could just practice two hands coming down low. I just want you to warm up. Start practicing and exploring any way you want to to throw and catch the ball. You've got 30 seconds. Go. Great 
job, everybody. Now let's get into some basic throwing and catching technique. Okay, we're gonna hold the ball in two hands, we're gonna throw it in the air and catch it with two hands. When I do this, you're gonna notice that my eyes track the ball. Tracking means I watch it. Wherever it goes, I watch it. And I'm gonna absorb the force of the ball. I'm going to pull it into my body so that it helps me not drop the ball. I'm tracking, absorb the force. When I absorb the force of the ball and pull it towards my body, you'll notice that I also bend my knees. Two hands, throw and catch. Awesome, let's do a couple more. Track it with your eyes, pull it into your butt. Great work. All right, now let's throw with one hand. Pick your right hand first, for example. Throw with one hand, catch with two. I'm still tracking with my eyes, and I'm still pulling the ball right into my body when I catch it. Awesome. How about now throwing and catching with my left hand? Um, throw it up with my left, catch with two hands. Don't forget to track and pull that ball in. Absorb the force. Good. Let's go back to our right hand. I'm going to throw with my right hand and catch with my right hand. I still have to track the ball, and now I really have to be sure that when I catch it, I pull it into my body to help me not drop it. Okay? Absorb the force, pull it right into your body. Throw with my right hand, catch with my right hand. Throw with my right hand, catch with my right hand. Good. Try a couple more. All right, let's go to our left. Throw with left. Catch with left. Throw with left. Catch with left. Good. Okay, how about throwing from one hand to the other? Still only one hand at a time. Throw with right. Catch with left. Throw with left. Catch with right. Tracking the ball with my eyes, absorbing it, and pulling it into my body so I do not drop it. Students, you have 30 more seconds to practice any of those basic throwing and catching tricks. Go for it. Way to go. Next challenges are levels challenges. We're going to start standing at a high level. I'm going to throw the ball in the air. I can use either hand, and then I'm going to squat down to a low level and catch the ball. Track it with my eyes, absorb the force. And you'll notice that when I caught it, because I'm catching it down low, what I do with my hands, and you probably remember from PE, is that I put my pinkies together. We call it pinky basket. Pinky basket, catch the ball, bring it into your butt. Start high, squat down, and catch low. Try that a bunch of times. Start high, catch it as close to the ground as you can without dropping it. Oh, and if you drop it, you make a mistake, no problem. Pick it up. Keep going. We never give up. Awesome. If you've been using your right hand a lot like me, now I'm going to switch to my left hand so I can practice on both sides of my body. Awesome job, everybody. Now we're going to switch up the levels. Now you're going to stand at a high level. You're going to throw the ball in the air. You're going to jump and try to catch the ball up high. Putting your hands up like a diamond. When you catch the ball above your head, like this, still absorb the force and pull it into your body. Just like this. Throw high, jump. Try to collect the ball and bring it into your body. Try to catch it high above your head. Make sure you're being careful about what's above you. Jump high, diamond, pull it into your body, absorb the force. Awesome. Now, start down low. Throw the ball in the air, jump up high, and catch it high. Awesome. Try that a couple more times. Start low, throw high, catch high, absorb the force. Make sure you're tracking, always watching the ball with your eyes. Awesome. All right, students, you've got 30 seconds to practice any of those levels tricks. Go. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
All right, it's time for some tricks. We're going to start with holding the ball in an underhand position. Underhand means my hand is literally under the ball. I'm going to throw the ball in the air, and then I'm going to catch it with an overhand grip. So underhand is like I'm holding a plate of food. Overhand is like I'm riding a bicycle. My hand is on my bike handle. Okay? Throw underhand, grab it, overhand. Try to do that five times. Throw underhand, catch, overhand. Try it on the other hand. Throw underhand, catch, overhand. Underhand, overhand. If you want an extra challenge, you can even do overhand grip, throw, and catch, overhand grip. So it's kind of like a flick up and then grab it. Overhand grip for both the throw and the catch. I bet I kind of look like a raptor right now. Try the other side. Overhand to overhand. Overhand to overhand. Awesome. How about the throw, clap, catch challenge? We love doing this in PE class. But remember, it works like a video game. You can't move on from level one um, until you beat that level. So if you throw the ball, you clap once and successfully catch, great job. Now you can move on to level two, which means there's two claps. Throw, clap, clap and catch. I beat level two, so now I can go to level three. Throw, three, and catch. I can't move on to the next level if I drop the ball. So if I'm on level four, one, two, three, four, and I don't catch it in time, I have to still work on level four. I never give up. One, two, three, four. Awesome. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Hey, students, you've got 30 seconds to see how high of a level you can get to. Be very safe about what's above you. Go. All right, your next challenge is to throw the ball, exercise, and catch. So it's throw, exercise, catch. You could do jumping jacks, you could do squats, you could try to do a burpee. I don't know if you'll have enough time to do that. Oh, nope, see? Throw, exercise, and catch. Make sure you're tracking the ball. How about throw, spin, and catch? Throw, spin, catch. You definitely want to keep on tracking the ball when you do this one. Throw, spin, and catch. Throw, dance, catch. Throw, dance, and catch. Throw, dance, catch. All right, students, you've got 30 seconds to practice any of those tricks. Go for it. All right, it looks like you've got some great practice with throwing and catching to yourself.